Hey guys, this is a 12 minute body bar workout and trust me, you're gonna feel it in all the right places tomorrow. As usual, I'm gonna do the first round with you, but feel free to do two to three rounds for a longer, more challenging workout. Welcome to Short Circuits. Make sure you're warmed up and let's get sweaty. I'm putting 15 seconds on the timer guys, it's the gym boss timer and our first combo is going to be a walking lunge reverse lunge combo. So you're going to walk forward twice and then reverse lunge, come back to the beginning and switch legs. Here we go, walk, walk, reverse, feet together and switch. You're in a slight hip hinge but your chest is high, it's lifted and you're trying to find that 90 degree angle on both legs. Excellent. Put the bar down on your mat, about the middle of the mat. You're going to come down into a plank on your forearms. Your legs are going to be straddling the bar and you're in a plank position. So you're bracing your core and you're stepping back and forth over the bar. Try to keep your butt as low as possible. Keep your shoulders over your elbows. This next one is so much fun, it's going to test your balance, so you're going to pick up the bar. It's a one leg deadlift and we're going to shift that bar from side to side, then come back to standing with a front shoulder raise. So you're going to hip hinge, take that bar out to one side, the other side, stand up tall, long arms on that shoulder raise, elbows slightly soft. You should feel this a lot in your glutes as they work hard to prevent you from falling over. And of course, we're going to repeat this on the other side. Nicely done. Place the bar on the floor slightly in front of the mat. You're going to come into a push-up position, so a plank position, either on your toes or on your knees. Your hands are going to be in front of the bar. You're going to do one push-up, then reach your hand behind the opposite hand. Pull the bar so it slides on the floor one way and then back to the start. Your alternating arms. This is probably my favorite move from this whole workout.
Okay, you're gonna turn over and you're gonna come into a V-sit position, so you're sitting on your bum. You can start with your heels on the floor, knees are bent. The body bar is just in front of your chest, your elbows are bent. You're gonna reach that bar overhead. And you can keep your feet here. If you feel strong, you can lift them off the floor. And when you're ready, you can add a twist. So you're gonna reach and twist. One side and then back up and other side. This one is definitely harder than it looks. Excellent. For this next move, we don't have to go too far. You're going to lie down on your back with the bar across your hips. Knees are bent. We're doing a one leg glute bridge combo with the bar. Lift your hips up. Take one foot off the floor. Leg is bent. Press that bar just against the thigh and press the thigh against the bar. You're lifting and lowering your hips. Keep your weight evenly distributed on your foot. So all four corners of your foot should be engaged. Your glutes should definitely remember this move tomorrow. All right, take a little break. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So make sure that you press your whole foot into the floor and really squeeze your glutes. We're moving into a side lunge pullback combo for this next move. So you're gonna stand up and you're gonna hold on to the top of the bar. The bar is gonna be vertical and you're gonna be stepping out into a lunge and pulling that bar back. See how deep you can come down into this lunge. Maybe you can touch the floor. If you feel ready, you can add a little balance challenge by lifting the foot off the floor as you bring it in. Well done, and of course we have to do the same move to the other side as well. So get ready, give yourself a little bit of space.
Excellent. Place the bar on the floor and come down onto your side for side plank. You can start on your knee if you would like. Your elbow is under your shoulder. Your bar should be in front of you. The top of the bar should be lined up with your shoulder. We're gonna start by lifting the bar and pulling it in towards our bodies and then lowering it. So it's a circular motion. When you're ready, come up onto your feet. And if you'd like, you can just lift that bar up and down. Totally up to you. Keep lifting that bar, you're doing great. If you want more challenge, you can stack your feet on top of each other. And same thing to the other side. This is the last exercise unless you're planning to repeat the circuit. Make sure the top of the bar is in line with your shoulder. You can be on your knee or your feet. And here we go. Lift, pull it in, down. Lift, pull it in and down. And when you're ready, if you're on your knee, try coming onto your feet. And then simply lift that bar up and down in front of you. It doesn't have to come too high, just to shoulder height. Keep your elbow soft and keep lifting through the hips. This one is definitely a lot harder than it looks. And you are done, or maybe you're gonna start all over again and do it one more time. Amazing job guys, thanks for working out with me today. It was a little harder than you thought, right? Now, if you need a bit more challenge, just take it back to the beginning, do a couple more rounds. And if you enjoyed the workout, make sure you click the like button, share, subscribe, and leave me your comments. New workouts are posted on Mondays and Thursdays. And until next time, take care of you, be healthy, be happy.